health officials in Alaska have confirmed the first death linked to the recently identified virus known as Alaska pox. An old immunocompromised man from the Kenai Peninsula south of Anchorage died in late January from the disease. The Alaska Department of Public Health announced that the individual receiving treatment was one of just seven cases of Alaska pox that had been reported. Authorities believe that the patient's immunocompromised state may have played a role in his death. It is unclear how he contracted the disease. After suffering from kidney and respiratory failure, he passed away and so people ought to be more aware rather than necessarily worried. The man did not travel recently, he lived alone in the woods, but it's probable that he got the illness from a cat he lived with. According to reports, the animal scratched him as the symptoms started. Small mammals were frequently hunted by this virus, despite the cat's negative test results, officials think the infection may have spread through its claws. The double-stranded DNA virus comes from the same genus as smallpox, monkeypox and cowpox. It is mainly prevalent in small mammals and was first discovered in an adult in Fairbanks, Alaska in 2015. On the website of the state of Alaska, it states that there has never been proof of the Alaska pox virus spreading from person to person. But since some orthopox viruses can spread by direct contact with skin lesions, we advise anyone who may have Alaska pox related skin lesions to cover the affected region with a bandage. The symptoms of Alaska pox include one or more skin lesions along with other symptoms like swollen lymph nodes and joint and or muscle pain. Immunocompromised people might be at increased risk for more severe illness. For more such video, like and subscribe our channel, thehealthsite.com.